welcome to Motorbike Adventures of Britain, Cumbria and the Lake District. Sponsored by Held UK, Rider Equipment and the Rooster Cafe and Restaurant in Penrith. Right, so when we come to Bruff Castle Ice Cream, not only can you enjoy one of the stupendous selection of flavours, we've got Bruff Castle, which is classed as a region of national treasure. And being a national treasure, it means that you can't dig anywhere, or do anything. But there have been coins found here over 3,000 years old. Gold coins. Loads of Roman coins. And in fact, just to the left of me over the wall is an old Roman bathhouse. Because the Romans based themselves here on one of the major routes from York to Carlisle. And I never knew that there was a road from York to Carlisle. So, this is the Roman fort, which were roughly 14 mile intervals along the main road from York to Carlisle in 78 to 80 AD. But, let's go and have a look at it. Hello. Gonna zip my jacket because I'm red hot. So we're now gonna go through the castle. And there we have the castle entrance. And we go inside. I just hope when the castle itself was a working environment, the floors were better than that. Can you imagine having to sweep them? From the 12th century onwards, from the 12th century onwards, Bruff Castle was used periodically as a home of a great noble household. The front part over there, hopefully the sun isn't blinding us too much. Lady Anne Clifford renovated these buildings in 1659 to 62. She also built the service wing behind you. And that's the service wing here. And there's a little plaque over there saying kitchen. The front half of the building was added in the 15th century and members of the household lived on its first and second floors. So that's what it used to look like. That bit there was that bit there. So not only was it used in the 1600s by Lady Anne Clifford and renovated, she also did a few more around the area. It was an area that initially was built by the Romans. When the Romans went, the Normans came in. So they based themselves here as well. So it's been used over the centuries for many different reasons. And one of the reasons you can use it for now is to discover history and to enjoy yourself. And to buy an ice cream and lick it till your heart's content whilst exploring Bruff Castle. So that is the end of this motorbike adventure feature. 
I hope you've enjoyed it and we join me again on another motorbike adventure of Britain. And until you do, bye bye for now.